hello guys. I want to sleep cast exactly this vase. Yeah, it will be the vase after I glaze it and fire uh, the second time. Uh, this one has biscuit firing only, uh, so it's not so fragile, but uh, it's still um, work in progress. Uh, I used uh, slip casting technique um, with a two-part mold for this one. And now I'm going to show you how I did it. Let's go! I have here a sphere mold. It's 18 cm and I am going to use this one for slip casting. A plaster mold is heavy but fragile. This mold has two separate parts designed to fit together. Then parts are held together with the rubber bands. First, I want to be sure that mold is clean. All leftovers will be visible on the final product. You can see so-called keys that should fit in the negative space at the other mold piece. And now rubber bands. When the form is held in one piece, liquid clay can be poured inside. Keep the opening of the mold free from bands. We are going to pour the clay there. I have my slip already prepared. You can see the process if you press the link in the right corner. I need to fill the mold all the way up, as close to the rim as possible. After some time, moisture will absorb out of the sleep. I'm going to add more sleep while I'm not happy with the thickness of the walls. Over time, the slip is forming a thick clay layer on the inside of the mold. Then you can open the mold and remove the object. I cut the rim to see how thick uh, my sphere is. The thickness inside will be the same as at the rim because I kept the level. Now I need to pour excess sleep uh, out of the mold. It can be difficult because mold is heavy.
one way till it dry, uh, so I'm using a heat gun to speed up the process. When the wall shrinks and are pulled away from the mold, you can take out an object. I took residue away and blend the visible lines in the middle of the sphere. You can see holes on it, there was a bubbles. I'm not sure whether it is visible at the video, but I can see the connection line between two parts. And some bumps are inside. They are there because the slip was not properly mixed. rounder and smoother than with hand building technique. 